Yeah, it is definitely devastating, but one child did survive all of this. Fire officials tell me they actually threw a push lawnmower through a window, and that's how they were able to get the child out. But sadly, six other people were just trapped inside. Fire officials say the house was just too engulfed in flames. Like you said, it was just so hot, so dangerous that it was melting part of their face masks. So they tried to put the fire out and they did put the fire out, but they had to do it from the outside of the structure. This is hands down the worst fire that, that I've been at. Uh, we run about 1800 calls a year in Woodward. Uh, so we see our share of fires and unfortunately we see our share of fatalities as well. Now the child that did survive the status of that child is unknown at this time. We do know they were taken to a hospital and the cause of the fire is still under investigation at this time. Now the fire chief also told me this was not only, you know, terribly sad for the friends and family of those victims and the community of Woodward as a whole, but also for those firefighters. So he tells me he's bringing in a stress debriefing expert from Oklahoma City to help with the firefighters mental health. Reporting live tonight, Aaron Bue, KOCO 5 News.